Hello guys, this is Lego Master 99 here, and today guys, I have a new combination lock to show you. It's a pretty new combination lock, I'm pretty sure. And yeah, so this is the interface here. This thing I hear is the interface. It's pretty big, but it's actually quite simple. So what you do is that you enter your the first co the, a combination in this panel here, and then you push this button. If it's a correct combination and it's in the correct order, it'll light up the first lap, and then you have to enter the second one. Hit that button. If it's correct, it goes in the second lap. If any of these are incorrect, it'll reach out the whole mechanism. And I'll show you what I'm talking about. So the first code I have is one 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 zero one zero one. Like that. So now if you hit this button, since I know it's a correct combination, that first lamp doesn't light up. Um I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. And so, as you guys can see, there's just a, gl a bit a glitch that I had to restart my Minecraft. So, anyway, um, as you see, the first slide lights up. Now, instead of getting the correct combination, when we have the code correct, this lamp will light up. But as you can see, it hasn't lit up. So, the thing you have to do now is enter in the second combination, which for me is to just push all these buttons. You turn the sound down a bit. You just hit all these buttons. And since they're T flip flops, they basically invert all the signals. Now, now if we hit this button, as you see the second lamp should light up, which it does. Perfect. Now the third combination, um, I forgot it. I actually wrote them down on signs here. Okay. So basically the third combination. I uh, you can change this to whatever you want. Um, like that. That's the third combination, I'm pretty sure. Now if we hit this button. As it lights up. Now let's say we enter in an incorrect fourth combination. As you guys can see, if we hit this button, instead of the fourth lamp lining up, all of them turn off, which they are not doing. It's just a, um... Yeah, there we go. It's just a glitch. There's lots of glitches in 1.4.2. I heard they're fixing some on Wednesday. But anyway, they all reset. And yeah, so you have to enter each code correctly. So now, if we actually enter in the correct code, and if we enter in all, all four codes correct, what will happen is that, um, is that this lamp will light up, and then you can have that attached to whatever you want. But I'll just enter in the f um, all the correct combinations correct. And yeah. So this is the last combination. Fat lamp lights up. Now this lamp lights up. Now you can hook this up to anything because its output is a redstone signal. And yeah, so it's this time in the video. I'm going to show you the redstone. But first, this is the reset button. So if you got a code incorrect, you can reset it. It resets everything. So yeah, now I'll show you the redstone. Okay guys, so this is all the redstone in the build. It is pretty big. And I'll, and I'll just, since it's all color-coded. And yeah, so this white segment here is the one white teeth flip flop array. So basically what that does is that one it's a, it makes a button press into like an output. And yeah, so it's just the one white teeth flip flop for all the buttons. Now the orange circuit is the input circuit. So this for the combination system. That's the input circuit. And then this is the input reset here. The red circuit is the output. So this wire here. The green circuit are the buffers from the array to the lamps. This yellow circuit is the is the um, passcode. It's completely hard coded. You can completely change it to whatever you want. It's hard coded into the mechanism. And this blue circuit here is probably the most important. This is the array. It calculates um, all the codes in order and stuff like that. And then the last circuit, this purple circuit here, is the reset. So if you get a code incorrect, it'll detect it and then send and then reset it. And yeah, so I will do a tutorial soon. Um, please like this video. It helps me a lot. Haha. <laughs> Since I'm not that big of a YouTube channel.
And yeah, so bye guys.